there's no landing. Right, here we go. Yeah, come on. Oh, got him. <laughs> One hit shot. Great. Welcome to BTD, BTD. It is a tactical third person and first person shooter split into episodes and we're going to give it a go. BTD, let's get it going. Let's go to episodes. Let's do the training. See what the game has to offer. Just throw us in there and see, get those controls down, etc. And then we take on a real deal episode. Here we go. Y ass to move, control to crouch. Okay. Interesting. Out. They probably set up the healing. Make it, yeah. Stamina, carry weight. Uh, interesting way to hold it. Left mouse button to use it. Uh, a lantern. Take the fuel. Take the med kits. Take them all. Let's use this lamp. The heavy the item. The blah blah blah. Switch perspective. Third person. Let's go first person. The right mouse button. Do we can't. Yep. P changes the view. Fire mode is Z. Now we're in semi. Actually, this is from a single fire. Okay. Weapon mode. Z. Let's go back to burst. And let's pick this up. Let's drop this weapon. Pick this one. With a scope. We're gonna hold on to this one. Directional mine. So we got a lantern. Don't need. Uh let's take a frag. Boom. Okay. Oh, we still have more. Okay. But let's keep going. We'll keep it. Reach the exit. Keep in low standard of dark. You're less likely to be detected. Of course. Are there any enemies? Oh, shit. I know there'd be freaking zombies here. Okay. Perfect. They, they all heard that shot.
Alright, I'm gonna say like why is they not dying? And you you think that's all over. Exits there. Well, so far, so good. Even though this is just a training area, I can tell the actual game itself might look pretty good. Some nice lighting effect there. Shadows. Objective complete. You reach the exit. All right. Accuracy was not great. But there you go. Episodes. Training done. Let's do the prologue. Several years have passed since mysterious monsters began to appear all over the world, indiscriminately attacking people as their environmental destruction and climate change continue to worsen. The origin of these monsters remained unknown, and the damage caused by them only exacerbated by the tension and friction between nations that had been escalating for some time. As a result, war broke out frequently around the world, leading to the collapse of governance and security. In this lawless world where bandits and monsters roam freely, only those who are armed and capable of defending themselves can survive. The prologue. Here we go. Let's see what it has. First real scenario. Here we are. I'm going to go first person. I don't think I can see much better that way. Take the axe. Dax the axe. Is that anything? No. Alright. Fire. Yeah, shadows and such. Looks pretty good. I don't think there are any much cause in here. Take this light. See, few I'm not gonna pick up because we don't have as many uh, slots. I have a melee weapon already. I have the axe. I'm not gonna pick up the knife. Med kit I will pick up because we might need it. Okay, right. All right, back to the axe. See we have here. The city was divided by walls to address the deteriorating security and residents were supposed to be protected in each district. But now the entire city has turned into a massive prison. Find a way out of this district. That's our objective. There's a zombie bed. See what we can do. Yeah, it looks good. Wait. Wait. They move. They're armed with axes as well. This could be interesting. Let's. We can't save. Alright, there's no saving. I'm gonna see if we can take him out. See what happens as a result. So we gotta ready each weapon before we use it. So I think we're gonna get seen no matter what. There's no leaning. Right, here we go. Yeah, come on. Oh, got him. <laughs> One headshot. Great. Is 
Maybe we can get this dude as well. I can sneak up on him, I will. But his movements seem a bit erratic. Yep, he's a bandit novice. Come on. Gotcha. Not bad. Chopped a knife. I have no problem with that. It's alright. They go down with one hit as they should. Freaking knife to the uh, axe to the face. What the heck is that? That's a dog like creature. We didn't get that in the, um, the training. What the heck? I kind of hate that the uh, crouch is not toggle. That is weird. Multiple of them too. I wanna, well, there's no way to get in that building. Let's see what we got, man. I'm gonna try to take it down. It's a canine monster. Okay. We beat it. Literally beat it to death. Travel through here. It still feels like we're loud even though we're crouched. Yeah, I heard a footstep here. Unless that's me. I think it's me. What's that noise? Gunshots? Gas cylinder. Yeah, that's not a doorway. Okay. That gun. It is a gun. But that is gunshots. Okay. Um. I think this has ammo. I can't really tell from my screen. Maybe not much, but it has something. So let's. I wish there was kind of like an inventory like screen. Why? So I can uh, reorganize stuff where I want it. So I think the, uh, there are other enemies here firing on maybe the dogs. Yeah, there's some fighting going on up there. I like that. Means the world is a bit more alive. We're not the only thing the AIs are gunning for, which is always a good thing. But yeah, I'm liking it so far. Looks solid in the graphics department. Gameplay. It's tense. I'm already feeling that. The diner up here, I don't know. Investigate. If there's a chance for me to go stealth in any of these types of games, I'm always gonna go to stealth route because I enjoy stealth. I feel it's more rewarding. I do hate that I can't save. I don't think saving is a thing for this game. I think we either beat the level or, do, or don't. Listen. Yeah, there's been some firing because there's some stuff dead over there. Let's see what's in this diner. Look at that. I like, I like this lighting. 
it's dark enough that where you will need the uh, it's a, fr a, fr a flag grenade. It's dark enough where you actually need the light and stuff. But we don't. That's another axe. We good on axes. I could use light, but I don't want to be seen. But. Oops. There's a light button. What? Button is the lantern. I think it is three. It's four. Let's see what's in here. Another grenade. Oh. Dead body. They got shot. Crowbar, an Uzi, X, full jukebox. Yeah, these things all got shot up before we got here. Goody. Put that away. Not much in there for us. Good exploration opportunity. Keep going. Another dead being. I like the zombie designs and such though. They look pretty good. They're different. I haven't seen them in other games, so they may they may indeed be original. Which is always a good thing. There's a fight. Yeah. Oh shit. Okay. Come on out. Oh, somebody's coming. You may have already heard the zombie. I don't hear other footsteps. All right, let's take you out. Ouch. Use the magic. get used there's stuff moving around but it might be down below I need another make it now freaking zombies all right I'm gonna let you be over there how about that the way out okay this case seems to require a power supply we need generator and I think we have to go down there oh you logical thing I'm trying to avoid using uh, the gun because I know the zombies will be attracted But we can outrun them because that one seems to not care about us now. I don't like the reach that they have though. Okay. 
Okay, we can hold it. Okay. Zombie down. Go down. Ooh, ouch. It's dark down here. Oh boy, here we go. <laughs> This one down. Another down. Our arm seem to be a little hurt now. See shite. Right. I'm assuming the generator's down here. More zombies ahead. Yeah. You really see me? All right. Keep going. I think I'd rather get all of you in one spot. Okay, we have a light on this gun, so that's good. That just only attracted more. There's another one. Why not? Let's keep going. I'm assuming there's a generator down here. Zombie. Even more zombies. Going that way for. Okay. Yeah, just keep funneling through here. Uh, bullets now. All right. Gonna we'll fight him in the uh, light. Oh crap! What the hell? Come on. Stay where I can see you. finally down but yeah that's b t d a b t d out so we got 15 kills that's not bad 
Specification for counting number of hits. Okay. Let's hit retry and see what happens. All right. It starts you all the way over. Interesting. All right. Uh, that is BTD. BTD. Not bad. It's a uh, tactical a survival game of sorts with the zombies, apparently. I didn't know zombies were in this. But you got bandits, etc. And it's all in multiple scenarios and such. And this is the first legit one, the prologue. But yeah, not bad. I just don't like restarting all the way over if you fail, but hey, that's just me. So I will catch you guys with the next one. Thanks for watching.